For example, if you see that the university is saying you can get this qualification in a very short time. Six months. Six months. Red flag. <laughs> <laughs> if you say that the, the price is um, a, qu a third of what the, the normal price is, red flag. If you find that the institution does not have a proper address, yeah. red flag. A red flag. Red flag, and that it's not accredited by a recognized accreditation uh, accreditation agency. Red flag. the quality of this paper, you know, it doesn't seem right. And that could be one of the red flags. Looking at the text as well to see if it's uniform throughout, how it's aligned, those are some of the things that they will look at. They will look to see if there is um, printed foil. Um, some universities, that's one of the security features. It has, um, you know, foil running through or, you know, like a seal of some kind, but it's made of foil. Then you have a seal, and if the ink is not printed through on the other side, you know, perhaps, that is computer generated. She noted the fact that an effort to avoid discrepancies when reviewing credentials and evaluating the computer programs since there can be a difference in entry requirements, program objectives, credits, grading systems, and culture. Businesses hiring individuals might also encounter fraudulent degrees. Therefore, in an effort to 